Hey folks, welcome to Board Game Casual. I know I typically celebrate these subscriber milestones in a little video short, but this one's such a big one, I wanted to take some extra time to express my gratitude. Thank you so much. To reach 500 subscribers in six months of creating the channel feels amazing. It feels so good to know that people are watching my videos and enjoying the content I create. I'm sure the videos might not seem like much, especially compared to some of the professionals out there, but I put a lot of thought and a lot of time into making them, and to hit 500 subs so quickly makes me feel validated in all the work I've been putting in. To give you some background, this channel is something I had the idea for for a long time. I really enjoy making videos. I have some other channels out there on YouTube from years ago, but I really wanted to make a channel about board games for two main reasons. First, I personally benefited so much from the videos created by others as I was coming into the board game hobby, I really wanted an opportunity to contribute something back. Considering myself as a casual gamer, I wanted to make content welcoming others into the hobby and help them navigate through the wide sea of games out there. When you're new, it can be a bit tricky to find your way, especially when a lot of the hardcore fans are focused on the, the new hotness and what the latest Kickstarters are that are launching this week. Secondly, and almost more importantly, board gaming is one of my few hobbies that is totally reliant on other people. I'm not much of a solo gamer, and so playing board games for me is very dependent on other people's schedules and finding the time to get together. This channel gives me an outlet. It allows me to scratch the board game itch, talk about board games, and enjoy the hobby in other ways. When starting the channel, admittedly, I had no idea if there would be an audience or if the board game community was already oversaturated with YouTubers making content. I set a basic goal for myself just to keep things in check, to see if I could reach 1,000 subscribers in one year for it to be sustainable. So the fact that the channel is at 500 subscribers in six months means we're headed in the right direction. I knew the growth wouldn't be linear, so I didn't expect to hit 500 subs so quickly. Thank you for all the kind words and the comments along the way. I really enjoy interacting with you all in the comments, on Board Game Geek, and on Reddit. T Mills, fifteen sixty five. I was glad to get you on board the Ready Set Bet train. Kendall W, you always have nice things to say. Best of luck on your channel as well. Admittedly, I didn't know there was so much to know about pens. Honestly, I've had so many great conversations with all of you. Candidly, my mind was blown to see actual companies like Game Nerds, AEG, and even Jamie Stegmeier himself comment on some of my videos. That was pretty cool. In fact, there's another milestone for the channel that just happened to come about in parallel as all this was going on. But that one's a bit of a surprise, which I'll talk about in an upcoming video very soon, so stay tuned. I'm also very close to having my first video that crosses 10,000 views, so that's also very exciting. Of course, there are a lot of videos that have very few views. By the way, if you loyal subscribers are looking for a video that I personally recommend, check out the Nerds Day video if you haven't. I feel like that one didn't get a lot of love, and personally, that was one of my favorites to make. I got a little loose with it and had some fun making it and telling the story of my experience. I'm also pretty proud of the latest video, a bit of a diversion from board games, but I was excited to show off the LED torches that I built by hand. Anyway, bringing it back to why we're celebrating today, 500 subscribers. Thank you again so much. Honestly, I have a lot of fun just making videos. But to see that people are watching them and finding them useful, I can't put into words how rewarding that feels. I'm certainly not slowing down. I've got a whole slew of videos I'm working on, including more prototyping tips in the Design Diary series, more recommendations of games I think people are sleeping on, and an even bigger list of videos I plan to make, so there's much, much more to come. So one final time, thank you again for subscribing. Thank you so much for liking and commenting. Thank you to anyone who upvotes my posts on BGG or Reddit, and anyone if they've shared my vids. More importantly, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time, here on Board Game Casual.